is that you sauce it? Hey waves, welcome back to Breezy's World. I'm Breezy and today I'm sharing with you guys my hair regimen. This video is long overdue. I've had so many people hit me up asking me, Breezy, what products do you use in your hair? How often do you do this? What do you think about this? I kept saying to myself, make a video. That way everyone could just go to the video because it's a lot. But I started answering people personally and then it just kind of got to the point where it was like, okay, it's too many people asking me the same thing. So I said, let me just go ahead and get this video out to y'all. The good thing about my hair regimen is that it's not a lot. It's not, you know, you go to some YouTubers hair regimen videos and it's like this long list of things and you're just like, uh-uh, uh-uh, I'm over it, sis. I'm, I'm not doing all of that. But me, I try to make things simple you know i'm already a busy mommy so when it comes to taking care of my hair i try to find things i try to find ways to make it easier for me and to cut time short i've been on this hair journey since 2012. i had heat damage and also damage from dyeing my hair and i recently cut my hair y'all <laughs> dumb let me tell you i tried to okay so there's this unicorn right I mean, there's a way of trimming your hair. They call it like the unicorn or something. And I caught myself trying to follow it, but I didn't really, I didn't do it correctly. So that's what I get. I didn't do it correctly. And I, end, end, I ended up jacking up my hair. Like my hair was looking toe up. So I do have other videos like my hair journey, pictures and stuff showing you where I started. <laughs> oh God, where I started and where I'm at now. And then I also have a video of how to promote hair growth or how to grow your hair long, fast. And here we are with the hair regimen um, as far as wash day. I wash my hair one day out of a week. So every Sunday is wash day. I like to start the week off fresh. So Sundays is hair wash day. And what I like to do is I like to do like an oil treatment or condition my hair before I shampoo my hair because to me, when I just start off my hair with just shampoo, it feels very dry. I'll do an oil treatment or I'll do conditioner and I'll just let, and I'll let my hair soak it up for a little bit before I start to shampoo my hair. So I might do the oil treatment the night before or the morning of, or I might condition it, you know, the morning of as well. So it goes oil treatment, shampoo, and then condition, or it goes condition, shampoo and then condition when i get to the after i shampoo my hair and i get to the condition part that's where i like to detangle my hair i like to either finger detangle my hair or paddle brush the, the paddle brush is actually my favorite um it doesn't take out a lot of my hair and it just when you use a lot of conditioner it makes it a whole lot easier to detangle your hair so you're not like tugging on your hair and pulling your hair out i'll, I'll apply the conditioner and then I will wash my body up or, and let the conditioner sit. And then I'll rinse the conditioner out. So after I'm done doing that, I apply a hair mask or I will apply a deep condition to my hair. And then I'll put a, a shower cap on my hair and I'll let that sit for 10 to 15 minutes. So once I apply the hair mask or the deep conditioner, I will um, get out the shower and by the time I get dressed and everything like that, it's time to rinse it out. So then I'll rinse the, the deep conditioner or the hair mask. I'll rinse that out. And then I will apply a leave-in conditioner. And the leave-in conditioners that I have been loving lately is the Dove leave-in conditioner or the Mayo leave-in conditioner. Now, the Dove one is, the Dove one is about $8.99. The Mayel one is $12.99. Mayel products are expensive. I got lucky and I purchased a lot of the pomegranate and honey one um, when they had their anniversary sale where they had everything for $5.99. So that's how come I tried it out because it was $5.99 and I fell in love with it because not only did it work for my hair, but it worked for Paisley hair as well. And although Paisley and I got, you know, curly hair, it's still a different type of texture. Her hair dries out very quickly where mine's will stay wet <laughs> and damped and 
you know, moisturized for a very long time. And then hers, it's like her hair will soak up the water in a product very quickly. And so yeah, I'll, so I'll either use the Dove leave-in or the Myel leave-in conditioner. I like, I like to apply the Main Choice hair growth oil. This oil is $12.99, so it is pretty pricey, but it does magic to the hair, man. It really does. You don't have to apply a lot. This is a four ounce um, bottle. So what I do is I'll just, you know, do a little here and then I'll, you know, put little drops here and there throughout my hair. And then I will massage my scalp. Oh, that felt good. Apply some to my hands and then I'll rub it and then I'll, I'll rub it on my hair and on my ends to kind of seal in the leave-in conditioner and everything like that to leave my hair moisturized. And my hair, my hair will feel moisturized and everything for like two to three days. And then after that, like when two to three days pass, then I will co-wash my hair. So in between wash, I will condition my hair. I will, when I take a shower, I'll um, apply conditioner, detangle my hair rinse it out and then I will apply leave-in conditioner or um, or the curl smooth smoothie I've been using the curl smoothie as a moisturizer because that's exactly what it feels like to me curl smoothie will define your curls without making it hard like a custard would or a hair gel so it will define your curls but still give it that soft texture. So when you do co-wash, you do want to use a moisturizer on your hair. You want to apply a moisturizer. I always wear my hair in a ponytail, y'all. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. I always wear my hair in a ponytail. I don't do much to my hair. I do hair videos, but after I do that style, I will take it down and I will put my hair in a ponytail and I'll put it in a bun. So I tuck my ends, which is very important. You want to take care of the ends of your hair because if you don't, it will create split ends which will break your hair off so I like to wear my hair in a bun or I will braid the ponytail nighttime is important there are nights where I am lazy and I don't put on a silk bonnet um, but I do have a silk pillowcase so if I don't sleep with the silk bonnet I at least have my silk pillowcase to help protect my hair make sure you apply oil to your scalp and the ends of your hair I would say every other day, every other day, whether it's in the beginning of the day when you style your hair or it's at nighttime and also the ends of your hair, I would suggest doing a protective hairstyle because when you do protective hairstyle, it gives you like a week or two without doing anything to your hair. And it's like the less that you touch your hair, the better. Um, that's why that's why i think guys hair grow faster than girls is because they don't do nothing to their hair they'll get their hair braided twisted or whatever and that's it they'll leave it alone but you know us girls we want to switch it up and all that stuff so when you're constantly pulling and tugging on your hair it's going to cause breakage so it's better to find a protective hairstyle where you can just leave your hair alone like i said i don't do nothing to my hair y'all besides the videos giving you guys you know a hairstyle or whatever i I don't wake up every day and be like, ooh, I'm gonna do this hairstyle on my hair today. Nope. <laughs> this hair goes straight into a ponytail. Um, unless I'm doing a video and I wanna switch it up or it's like a special occasion or something, then I'll wear my hair out like this. But otherwise, it's in a ponytail in a bun. That's it. <laughs> if you guys have any questions, you can go ahead and comment down below or you can hit me up in the description box. I have my Instagram on there and also my email address so you guys can always hit me up i'll respond back to you guys subscribe if you haven't already become a wave of mine and i'll see you guys in the next video bye y'all